Hello everyone, I'm Elijah, welcome to Music Greatness. For today's lesson, I'm going to break down Make You Feel My Love. It goes like this. Okay, for this first part, I'm going to break down the intro of the song by playing in the key of B flat major. And for the chords, we're starting with a B flat. Playing octave B flat on the left with B flat D F right hand. Followed by F of A, octave A on the left. C, F, A, right hand. Then we have A flat major, so we're playing off key. With octave A flat on the left. A flat, C, E flat, right hand. Move in to E flat major. Octave E flat, that's for the left and my right hand plays G, B flat, E flat. So E flat, first inversion. And then for the next one, I'm going to take down G by one half step to play G flat. And now I'm playing E flat minor. After that, we're back on B flat with a different inversion, so my right hand plays F, B flat and D now, still with octave B flat on the left. And then I'm going to go up with C7, octave C on the left, G, B flat and E for the right. And finally, we're playing E flat over F, octave F on the left, and I'm playing G, B flat, E flat on my right hand. And that's all for the chords. All right, let's play the intro. Two, three, four, one, two, and three, and four, and one, two, and three, and four, and one, two, and three, and four. So for the chord progression, we have B flat, F over A, going to A flat. All right. So I'm playing B flat on the first beat. And then, like I'm going to do a lot in the song, I'm going to replay the notes on my right hand on the end of the second beat. One, two, and three, four. Okay. After that, I'm going to replay the tap note on the left, so B flat, and also B flat alone on my right hand. And then I'm playing this D with B flat. That's on my right hand. So one, two, and three, and four, and one, two, and three, and four. After that, we're landing on F over A, playing this. One, two, and three, and four, and one. So, play F over A on the first beat of the measure. But instead of replaying the same notes on the end of the second beat, you're going to invert the F and play A, C, F. So, one, two, and three, and four, and... After that, you have A and F played at the same time, followed by C alone. So, one, two, and three, and four, E, and the one. Again, one, two, and three, and four, E, and the one. Okay, now before going to A flat, we have an important detail that I have to mention. 
I have a quick note played before the chord. And that's E flat, and that note will be played on the A uh of the fourth beat. So one E and, two E and, three E and, four E and. I'm going to play that on the A uh of the fourth beat. And then play the chord on the first beat. So we're going to use that pattern a lot in the song. So F over A. A quick E flat and then play A flat major on the first beat. For E and the one. Just like this. Okay, now on A flat major, we're playing this. One, two, and three, E, and four, E, and one. Okay, let me slow it down. We have A flat major played on the first beat. We play the notes on the end of the second beat for your right hand. Then play A flat alone on your right. And you have a quick A flat, the low A flat on your left, played on the O uh of the third beat before moving up to the top A flat on the left with B flat and E flat on the right hand and that's on the fourth beat okay and then after that play A flat on your right hand like this one two and three E and the four E and the one so again before moving to E flat we have quick note played right before and that note here is B flat so once again on A flat three four one two and three and a four E and a one all right coming up next we're playing E flat E flat minor and then B flat major goes like this. Two, three, four. One, two, and three, and four, and one, two, and three, and four, e, and a one. Two, and three, and four, and. So we have E flat on the first beat. We play the notes on your right hand on the end of the second. Then on the fourth beat, followed by the end of the fourth beat, you have E flat, top note on the left, and then G on your right hand. So one, two, and three, and four, and. And then before playing E flat minor, you have again a quick B flat on the A uh of the fourth beat. Then play E flat minor, and then we have this. One, two, and three, and four, E, and. So I played E flat minor, first beat, replaying the notes on my right on the end of the second. Then I'm going to play my low E flat again, followed by this. I'm first playing three notes at the same time. That's G flat, B flat with F, like this. Then I'm playing E flat alone and replaying the G flat. Four E and. So one, two, and three, and four E and. One, two, and three, and four E and the Again, on the A uh of the fourth beat, I'm playing one quick F before playing B flat major with the second inversion on the right hand. So play that on the first beat. We play the notes on the end of the second. And then you have this F and D played at the same time, followed by one B flat. So. One, two, and three, and four, and a one. One, two, and three, and four, and a one. 
So before moving to the next, to the next chord, which is C7, I have a quick G played on the left. So following the B flat, we're going to play C7, E flat over F, and then finish the intro back on B flat major. Goes like this. Two, three, four, one and two and three and four and one. Two and three and four and a one. So we're playing C7 on the first beat. And then from here, we're going to replay the notes inside of the chord. So play the full chord on the first beat, then replay G on your right, the top C on your left, followed by B flat on your right. One and two and the. Okay, so on the O of the second beat, I'm going to play a quick C before playing E flat over F on the third. Three, four, one and two and a three and four and and then pretty much the same pattern here I'm playing the full chord on the third beat and then I'm going to replay notes inside of that chord so here that's G on my right hand the low F on my left and then again B flat on my right three and four and one three and four and one so moving to the next chord which is b flat i'm not going to play a quick note before going to it so simply play b flat on the first beat so again for c7 and e flat over f Three, four E and a one and two E and a three and four and one. Perfect. Now to finish the intro, we're playing over B flat. Three, four, one, two and three and four and a one. So play the chord on the first beat. On the end of the second beat, we're not going to replay the same notes, but we're going to invert the chord to play B flat D F on the root position. So one, two, and three, and four, and. After that, play F on your right hand, then the top B flat on your left, followed by B flat and F on your right hand, the two notes at the same time. So. One, two, and three, and four, and, and four, and. And then before playing the first chord of verse one, you have a quick F played on the A uh of the fourth beat. Two, three, four. One, two, and three, and four, and the one. And that's all for the intro. Let's replay that again, the entire section, slow tempo. Two, three, four. One, two, and three, and four, and four. Two, and three, and four, and one. Two, and three, and four, and the one. Two, and Three and four and the one, two and three and four and the one, two and three and four and the one and two and three and four and one, two and three and four and the one. Okay, let's recap and replay the intro at full speed.
And that's all for this first part. For the rest of the song, please head over to musicgreatness.com. As always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.